What is Crack Lacking Collectors? Collect Star here again today, and today we're going to be doing the Sunday session. And I'm going to be talking about some giveaways, I'm going to be talking about some videos of the week, or one video of the week, and a shout out, one shout out this week. And I'm going to be announcing the giveaway winners today as well. So keep your eyes locked on my screen and <laughs> see if you actually won something. All right, today, guys, we're going to knock in. As you can see in front of me, we've got a lot of products in front of me, but we're going to talk about that soon. Uh, but first, I want to get out a massive shout out to a channel called M's Dad. He's an epic human being, guys. This guy is a really good guy. He uh, usually does a lot of Funko stuff, really big in the Funko community. He's got quite a lot of subscribers. Um, but he's just really giving. He always helps out the other people in the community, always trying to get people more subscribers, get their content out there to be seen by other people. And it's just, his live streams are just really good to get amongst. Um, and I've stumbled across them a few times and always get a lot of support from the Funko community And I just want to thank M's dad for the opportunity to do that uh, To always rock up on your platform and just always have a good time Talk about Funko, talk about your life and it's just really interesting He has helped me out a lot guys, so I'm pretty happy So I'm pretty appreciative about that and I just want to thank you man uh, M's dad uh, Really awesome guy, awesome channel Part of a really awesome community So I'll leave his link in the description below if you want to go check him out uh, really awesome guy. Moving on now for the shout outs, or shout out, we're going to be talking about video of the week. Now the video of the week to me is going to go to Andy and Son TCG. Now these guys open up uh, some really awesome Dragon Ball Super cards. I really like watching people open up Dragon Ball Super cards. Uh, I really enjoy it, I really do. Um, so these guys get video of the week. Go check this video out guys, if you really like what I do with my Dragon Ball Super cards, you really like the cards, go check these guys out. Really, really awesome uh, video. And hopefully it helps you out a bit guys. Hopefully some people come across over to you guys and give you some love as well. So that is my video of the week. And now we're gonna move on to the giveaways. All right guys, so last week I had my 400 subscriber special. And I asked you guys to write your collecting stories down in the comments. When you start collecting, what you start collecting, how much stuff you've been collecting, whatever you wanted to talk about really. And I was gonna give one drawing away because that's, that's the giveaway guys. I'll draw a picture of whatever you want and give it to you guys in a frame photograph uh, frame. I decided that I needed to actually do two runner-ups because the stories were just too good. Um, there's three stories in there that really interested me, really got me reading, and I really liked that. That's the whole point of why I did that uh, episode and I uh, wanted you guys to do that. So I'm going to um, announce the winner and read their story out, and I'm going to announce the, the other two. All right, guys, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to give out three drawings. Two of them are going to be not as big as the other one and I'll just send them off to you guys. The winner of this is going to go to Cardboard Cravings. Uh, I picked him for a number of reasons really because I related so much to the story. Um, he not only collects Pokemon cards, he collects uh, Warhammer as well and I could really relate to his story. His story is basically identical to mine really. When I was looking at it, it actually reminded me of how I started collecting things as well. So that's why you win man and I'm going to read your story out now to everyone. Right, where to start Laugh Out Loud? I first got into the collector bugger about 1996 to 1997 when my older brother came home with some Magic the Gathering cards and I just knew that I was going to be a card collector. I picked up the Star Trek CCG starter deck, video coming, looking forward to that. Uh, that weekend, laugh out loud. The following week I bought Magic the Gathering cards. A few weeks later, someone showed me a White Dwarf magazine and I was hooked on that too. My first ever Warhammer figs with Dark Angels. Uh, excellent choice there, man. Um, Dark Angels is actually one of my favorite uh, uh, Space Marine uh, chapters, if I'm being honest myself. But we'll continue on with this. I've got a land speeder, a tactical, tactical squad, a bike, and Azrael. That's a nice character. Um, I lost the hunger for collecting in my Rebel years, 20 to 25, but I'm back on the collector train, boy. <laughs> Got a very nice collection these days. Magic the Gathering, Pokemon, Dragon Ball Super, Warhammer, Swords, Figures, and just last week, I bought some Transformers TCG. All right, guys, so that related to me so much. I'm gonna tell my story now, and you guys can sort of understand how much that means. Basically, I started collecting Pokemon cards in 1999, and when 2002 came around, I believe I picked up a White Dwarf magazine also had a Chaos Space Marine on the front of it. If I can show you pictures or find the magazine, I'll just show you uh, in the background here when I edit it. But um, I remember flipping through there, the magazine, and I remember seeing this amazing Howling Griffin's army. And for those who don't know what that is, it's a Space Marine uh, chapter, uh, but it was done in an amazing color scheme, and it just got me hooked. And I asked my dad for uh, my birthday if I get a starter set of Space Marines, and he just said, no, it's too expensive. Um, so a couple years later, I was a bit of a, uh, 
I was a bit older then and I started getting into it. My first ever box of 40k, Warhammer 40k was uh, some Terminators, those really old ones. And I ended up picking up those and I didn't know much about the game and obviously I, went, I should have went for something more basic for my troops choices, but I went for something too elite. So I couldn't actually play with it or anything. But um, yeah, that was my Warhammer story. And then after that, I got into Yu-Gi-Oh and all that afterwards. So it's... Uh, and also when I was a bit uh, older in my, when I was like 20 years old and stuff like that too, I was also a bit of a rebel. Uh, I used to get around drinking a lot, um, getting in trouble with the coppers. I was a bit of a delinquent when I was younger guys, but that's just, I think all boys and girls do that sometimes, you know. We are, uh, you know, we do that, we go through that sort of stage in life. Yeah, so that story relates to me so much. That's why you are the winner, mate. And um, I really enjoyed your story. That's the best one I saw. Now the second runner ups is gonna be uh, Milltown Pokemon uh, Gym and Peanut Butter. Uh, your stories are really epic too. Um, I really enjoyed the, uh, reading those and they, you know, as I said, I relate to them a bit. So I just thought it'd be really good to uh, draw you guys something simple uh, compared to uh, Cardboard Craving. I'll do you something uh, pretty cool and I'll draw your favorite, whatever you guys want. I think in favorite Pokemon for the next two, just let me know what you guys want. All three of you guys winners, let me know what you want in the comments. We'll talk about it. But um, the, the runner-ups, uh, just give me something simple. It's just going to be a drawing, and it's going to be signed by me. All three will be signed by me, sent to you guys, and yeah. So there you go, guys. That's the giveaway winners. Um, also, this will take a while to do, so don't expect it in the next uh, like next week. Um, everything I send from Australia always takes a while to get to people, and this will probably take even longer. So just remember that, guys. Don't keep asking me for it. I'll be making a video on the pictures when I get them done and also be sending them off to you guys. All right guys, so that's uh, gonna be it for that. Uh, we're gonna be talking about some stuff I have here for this week's uh, videos. We've got some burning shadows. Now I've decided to get on the on the bandwagon here and start hunting the Charizard. Um, I just really wanna get that Charizard guys. So I've got a ton of packs here for burning shadows. I've got elite trainer box coming in the mail too for next week. So we're gonna be doing that. I'm gonna be opening up some burning shadows for a, a a while until uh, the new set comes out. Uh, I think it's Thunderclap. I can't remember the exact uh, name of it, but that'll be coming out in November. But it's going to be Burning Shadows, and I really want to get that Charizard. It's about time I got it. Um, I really want to get it. Also, guys, behind here we've got some Yu-Gi-Oh. I've got some. I've got a really nice Yu-Gi-Oh collection uh, cardboard edition, and it's got the God cards on there. I love Slough the Sky Dragon, guys. It's my favorite card of all time when it comes to Yu-Gi-Oh. Um, I've got a few of these already, but I don't have the uh, limited edition one. I think this is a limited edition one. I could be, be wrong. But um, yeah, guys, I really want to get this. Uh, it's got some really awesome packs in here as well. I just really want to open up some Yu-Gi-Oh! Because I feel like I've been really neglecting uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! So I would like to really open this up this week. So we're going to open this up this week. And I really feel like we're going to pull some really nice cards out of it. And I just really wanted to do some Yu-Gi-Oh! Also, guys, we got some Fallout. The brand new Fallout Pops. I'll be doing a pop review of that. And I really can't wait to get into these as well. It's going to be really awesome. So that's just about uh, wraps it up for me today, guys. Uh, oh, also, guys, I've got to tell you guys, for anyone who has Snups on uh, the social media app of Snups, where everyone puts their collections up and stuff, um, I've got my Snups up now. It's going to be linked in the description. I've also got in my little in my banner up there as well. It's got a little uh, globe uh, icon. You just click on that. And I've got some really awesome cards going up on there, and just one of my collection is going to be up on that uh, site in the next future. It's going to be everything I own over time. So if you guys have a Snups account, uh, or you don't have one already, you want to start one up, go check out my Snups out, guys. It'd be really appreciative. Um, what else? Is there something else I had to say? Oh, yeah, that giveaway. That giveaway will be coming out this week, so keep your eyes out for that giveaway. It can pop out any time. It's a Vintage Jungle uh, holographic Pokemon card. Keep your eyes out. And make sure you, you catch it when you can. All right, guys, I'm gonna leave it there. That's the Sunday session. Really need to move on and get some videos done. We're gonna leave it there. And for you collectors out there, keep on collecting. And I'll see you in the next one. All right, time out.